Hey guys, what's going on? Autofocus on the Sony ZV-1 is some of the best in the world, but the time will come when you're going to have to shoot manual focus for whatever reason. And I'm going to show you next how to nail manual focus every single time. Let's go. My name is Vic Barry and for techniques, tips and thoughts on all things video, please consider hitting subscribe, especially if you find this video useful. As we can see here, the autofocus is focusing on the grid. No matter how close I bring it, it can't really focus on what's behind it. And this is where manual focus comes in. So the first step is to enable manual focus, which I've got set up as a shortcut. So now we're on manual focus and we can see some red on the screen. The next step after this is to actually dial in the focus. So I've got this also set up as a shortcut and shortcuts are a very easy way to completely up your game with the Sony ZV-1. And the only way to dial in focus like this, the easy way is to use a shortcut. But in a second, I'm gonna show you guys how to do that. So do not worry. Right, now let's dial in the focus. Now I'm pushing to the right, which is the shortcut I've set up. And then we're gonna use the jog wheel here to to make things focus or not so as we can see the focal plane is changing here and once you see red that means whatever is in red is in focus and we can see now we've got this wonderful blurred effect and we can see through this grid now i know what you're saying vic that wasn't exactly so hard but i'm kind of confusing the shortcuts okay so the shortcuts are going to be physical buttons that you're going to have to change within the settings and this could not be easier but you need to combo the two of these up to get manual focus working so you can dial it in so let's get back to the studio and let's get this manual focus shortcuts set up so you guys can absolutely kill it before I fall down the steps. Back in the studio, Sony ZV-1 in hand. Let's show you guys how to avail of these shortcuts. And keep in mind, to do manual focus while you're recording, this is the only way to do it when you're recording. Otherwise, you're gonna have to stop and go into the menus. Step number one is to enable manual focus. First off, I do this on the center button. What we're doing is we're in custom operation one. Select the movie custom key. So the center button is number two. Let's select this and select autofocus, manual focus, control toggle. And now if we go back and we press menu and go back to the actual camera itself and we press the center button, we can see it changes from autofocus to manual focus. Next up is the actual focusing distance itself. This is where you use the control wheel to actually dial in your focus. So I find the shortcut that works best for me, but you can put it in whatever button you want, is the actual right button here. We're going into menu, camera setup, we're on custom key, and let's go down to number four, which is the actual option here for the right button. I'm gonna select AF2, and then I'm gonna select set focus. Now for all of this to work, you gotta be in manual focus first off, so in this case I'm pressing the center button, then I'm gonna to push to the right, and now we can change your focus to whatever way we want, simply by just turning the wheel. And it's as easy as that to set up manual focus in the Sony ZV-1. This is a great combo of shortcuts and using shortcuts really does up your game with the Sony ZV-1. And once you get into this practice, you will wonder why the heck you never use manual focus before, for depending on what type of shot you're using, this can be a real game changer. Speaking of game changer, there's a video up here that I think you guys will absolutely love. And hopefully this week, we will see some GoPro Hero 9 Black videos when it ever turns up. Don't stop fighting for yourself. I don't put on pants.